Lim Lip Eng has urged the Attorney General's chambers to charge a police escort personnel who allegedly assaulted a deaf e-hailing driver at a hotel in Kuala Lumpur. In a statement today, he said the police assault was caught on camera, making it a pretty clear-cut case and questioned what was taking so long. He said it has been three months and the AG still hasn't decided whether to charge the officer with assault. Lim also raised concerns about Inspector General of Police Razaruddin Hussein's grasp of the double jeopardy. He asked the AGC to clarify the IGP's usage of it in justifying the lack of disciplinary measures taken against the police personnel. He echoed the stance of lawyer N. Surendran, who cited Article 7, Bracket 2 of the Constitution, which prohibits prosecuting an individual twice for the same offense. He said this provision applies exclusively to criminal proceedings and not to internal disciplinary inquiries within the police force. Yesterday, it was reported that Raza Rudin said the police officer who allegedly assaulted the deaf e-hailing driver had been disciplined, but not for the assault case. Instead, he said it was over the officer's failure to declare assets. Razarudin clarified that it would be double jeopardy if the officer was reprimanded internally, as the latter is biz being investigated under Section 323 of the Penal Code for causing voluntary hurt.